Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing a fashion video, fashion related video. As you guys may know, or if you guys don't know, Twice is going on tour soon. I think next week they start their tour. And I just wanted to make a video showing you guys some cute outfit ideas for Twice concerts if you guys are planning on going. As you guys know, I love fashion. I love dressing up and just building outfits. It'd be a cute idea to show you guys some outfit ideas that I have specifically for Twice's tour. It's just gonna be some um, twice inspired outfits so i hope you guys get some inspiration with the outfits that i'm going to show you guys today i had a lot of fun filming these and building these outfits i feel like twice overall is known for a very like girly very pastel kind of aesthetic to them and so i really tried to show that with the outfits that i made but also they do rock that like bad like aesthetic i don't know how to explain it i'm gonna show you guys 10 outfits also if you guys are planning to go to twice's concert let me know which dates you guys are going to i'm going to the oakland one i think it's february 18th that's like that's like next week oh my gosh okay so the first outfit that i chose is this pink and white outfit i'm wearing this cute like captain corduroy hat that i got from h&m i know urban outfitter sells a bunch of these in different colors i'm also wearing this pink blazer that i got from depop i'm wearing this tennis skirt that i got from yes style and i paired it with just a simple white tank top and then just my basic nikes and then i'm pairing it with this cute shoulder bag from bella doña i'll tag their instagram they sell really cute purses and stuff like that i feel like twice does a lot of pink and white concepts and so i knew i wanted to do a pink and white outfit you could also change the color of the blazer or the hat you could do blue and white purple and white red and white green and white but i definitely like like the corduroy hat matching the blazer i feel like a lot of people also wear these tennis skirts to concerts i feel like it's a popular thing to wear it's very common for a lot of people to wear them and i agree i feel like they're really cute they go with literally everything i feel like having a tennis skirt in your wardrobe will really it will just be good in your wardrobe okay everyone get a tennis skirt they're really cute they're really comfy they're not too short yeah there's also a bunch of different colors as well okay the second outfit is this like roughly romper that i got from urban outfitters it kind of looks a bit like weird on me because it's really poofy from the bottom and i didn't even realize it was a romper until like i put it on and i realized it was a romper because i thought it was a dress but it's this cute little baby yellow romper with ruffles on the top and on the bottom and i'm wearing my docks the mary jane docks and then i'm just wearing some cute white sunglasses that i got from target this little mini yellow pouch that Fernanda gave me and it has like a clear little thingy on the back so you could put like a PC or something. This outfit gives me a lot of like spring vibes. Are we in spring? We are, huh? No, we're in winter. I don't know. It gives me a lot of spring vibes, a lot of like garden vibes. So if you guys have any like roughly dresses or roughly rompers, I feel like that'd be a really cute item to wear to the concert. It's really flowy. It's really comfortable. It's not too tight, you know, if it's really like relaxed on your body. I'd really recommend any flowy or roughly. I don't even know that's a word but like roughly material because you know you're gonna be jumping and dancing you want to be as comfortable as possible when i first bought this dress i wanted to go for that like ariana grande look i'll show some pictures of like some kind of inspiration that i was going for i don't know what the kind of dresses these are called but they're like they fit kind of like short on you like they're supposed to look kind of like triangle-ish on you there's a name for that i just don't know what it's called but like these kinds of dresses if you guys like this kind of style you guys should definitely get dresses like this i think they're really really cute I think it fits the vibe of like twice okay the next outfit is a bit more earth toned a lot less brighter and colorful i'm wearing this striped vest that i got from fernanda i think she thrifted it from a goodwill i'm wearing another tennis skirt a black tennis skirt that i also got from yes style i'm wearing a headband that i got from claire's i'm wearing the same white socks and i paired them with these cute black loafers that i got at a thrift store this brown heart mini handbag that i got from bella doña as well if you guys aren't really into like the colorful look like bright yellow bright pink kind of look you guys can always go for this brownish like earth toned kind of outfit so yeah something like this with any browns creams beige it gives me very much like schoolgirl vibes which i think is a concept that they've done before as well personally i didn't really like having the vest over the skirt i prefer having cropped tops because i feel like it shows your figure a bit better so i decided to tie the vest from the back with just a hair tie 
high and so you could see like a bit of my stomach and then i also decided to pair the outfit with these brown sunglasses that i got from urban outfitters like i said it gives me very much school vibes school girl vibes and i think it's a vibe i think it's really really cute you could do the same outfit and change just change the colors if you have a more colorful vest you can do that as well i feel like vests are a really cute and comfy thing to wear especially to concerts just because it's not tight fitting you know it's very loose on your body this next outfit reminds me a lot of la familia peluche a lot of people always tease me about it because i wear a lot of fuzzy hats fuzzy purses fuzzy clothing but i'm wearing this orange dress that i got from depop it has cute white ruffles at the bottom and then i'm wearing my doc martens the platform ones and then i'm wearing my matcha green fuzzy bag that i got from urban outfitters and then i'm pairing the whole outfit off with this fuzzy bucket hat that i also got from urban outfitters it's a cute floral bucket hat it has green flowers and like it's an orange peachy color and it's really fuzzy it's really really soft i was kind of iffy at first about this outfit i wasn't sure if it was cute or not i feel like it looks a bit much this might not be everyone's style i know it's very very different especially with like the fuzzy hat and the fuzzy bag green and orange are really cute colors to match together and i did that here with this outfit with the green flower the green bag and then the orange dress and the peach hat so those two colors uh, go really well together if you guys have any of those colors in your wardrobe you can play around with that and just match a bunch of tops with bottoms so yeah just experiment with the colors that you have in your wardrobe because a lot of colors that you wouldn't think that would go together actually look good together it's just a matter of trying a bunch of things on and just seeing what works best okay this next outfit is a bit more of a scandalous one different vibe from the ones i've shown you before but i'm wearing this red velvet huh, red velvet this red velvet vest that i got from urban outfitters and i put a black tank top under because i didn't really want to show cleavage or like boots you know <laughs> and then i'm wearing this black skirt that i got from depop and i'm wearing my knee-high boots that i got from dsw they're called maiden girl coretta boots and then i'm wearing this mini black purse that i got from depop as well and i'm just wearing these orange tinted black sunglasses that i got from urban outfitters this outfit reminds me of their cry for me photo shoot concept with the red and black and that's what kind of inspired this outfit red and black go really well together if you want to go for that like sophisticated like mature look i guess you could say also maybe because the top is red velvet material but this outfit also just reminds me of red velvet <laughs> like the k-pop group so yeah this is a much more fancier outfit a much more like i'm so bad with adjectives with describing outfits but it's a much more mature kind of look if that's what you're going for if you don't want the like girly-ish kind of look so yeah this is a possible outfit that you guys can try if you guys have knee-high boots knee-high boots are really cute i feel like they're a necessity in your wardrobe the amount of times that i've worn those knee-high boots are just like insane they're so comfortable and since they're platform they're not that hard to walk especially going to concerts if you're going to be there like the whole day it hurts after a while but those they're they're really comfy i definitely recommend if you guys are looking for knee-high boots this next outfit is an all blue outfit i'm wearing this blue top that i got from paxson a blue skirt that i also got from paxson and i'm wearing some white skate highs from vans and i'm wearing this cream mini handbag and the white sunglasses from target i really like this outfit because i think going all monochrome for just any outfit is such a like pleasing feeling i guess or just pleasing to look at i love wearing all of one color like i love wearing all green or all pink or all blue i know it's kind of intimidating at first just wearing all of one color because you kind of stand out you know especially for twice concert for my outfit i'm planning on wearing all blue blue primarily because i have blue hair and i've just been in love with the color blue and then fernanda she's planning on wearing all pink and then my other friends are also planning on wearing monochrome outfits to so like all of one color i feel like it's so cute if it's like a group of you guys going to the twice concert if each of you wore like all one color that's a cool idea for you guys to experiment with and then i also did my hair in this half up half down hairdo so i just separate the top of my hair and i do a little like ponytail at the top and then i do like side bangs so i have this like side part like this and then just the bottom of my hair is down but yeah it's a really cute hairstyle um i always get a bunch of compliments whenever i do that hairstyle especially with my blue hair i feel like it just like makes it pop even more you know this next outfit is a much more less showy kind of outfit if you don't want to show too much skin or just not going for that kind of vibe i'm wearing these cream corduroy pants 
just got them from Urban Outfitters. They're really, really comfortable. Corduroy in general, corduroy pants are really comfortable if you don't want to wear jeans or just any tight fitting pants, you know? And also corduroy, they tend to have a lot of different colors, a lot of different shades. Of those colors, I'm pairing it with this white cropped tight fitting shirt that I got from Paxson. And then I'm wearing this pink button up, this short sleeve button up that I got from the thrift store. I noticed thrift stores have a lot of cute, colorful in pattern button ups that I think look really cute if you layer them with like a white turtleneck or a white shirt underneath. And I really like the shade of this shirt, this like bubblegum pink. I knew when I bought it that I wanted to style it like this. I'm wearing these pink and white sunglasses that I also got from Urban Outfitters. And I'm wearing this pink mini purse that I got from Depop. And I just paired off the whole outfit with my white Nikes. And I decided to do my hair in two pigtails to give more of that like girly look. But yeah, this is an option if you guys don't want to wear a skirt or a dress or shorts or like show legs, you know, because it might be cold in certain locations. This outfit kind of gives me like beachy vibe. It feels like I'm going to go walk down the beach and just like chill and like look at the sunset. I think it's because of the button up. But yeah, if you guys own any cute colorful button ups and you guys aren't sure how to style it because they do kind of make you look kind of boxy i think layering is a good idea with pieces like that where you kind of struggle how to style i think adding a bunch of accessories are like your best friend like adding sunglasses layering a bunch of necklaces adding a lot of rings this next outfit is a much more chic kind of look i hope that best describes this outfit i think chic is the right word I could be wrong, I could be totally off, but it's a much more like sophisticated look. Again, like the other outfit that I said that was sophisticated. <laughs> I'm wearing this furry vest that I got from Goodwill, this black furry vest, and I'm wearing these black Levi's, they're boot cut. Since they're boot cut, I'm wearing my knee high boots, and then I'm wearing this cute matcha green top that I got from Urban Outfitters, it's a long sleeve, and then I'm wearing this green purse that I got from Goodwill, and I'm wearing these black sunglasses. That I got from Target and I just did my hair in a clip. I really like this vibe as well. Like I said, it's a lot more sophisticated. If you guys have any cool vests, any furry vests or any leather vests, I have a few leather vests as well. Wearing a colorful bright top under those vests look really good. I recently took some pictures of me wearing this black leather vest and I put a hot pink long sleeve underneath and I think it's such a vibe. Just wearing all black and then having like a splash of color in that outfit, I think I think really makes you pop and just makes the outfit overall pop even more. I think this outfit is really cute. It makes me feel like I'm gonna go like on a motorcycle and like go on the freeway and just like speed. <laughs> I also think boot cut jeans look really good on the figure, especially these jeans. I love these jeans. They're Levi's. I got them at the Levi's store. They fit really well. I like how they fit on my waist and just how they make my legs and my butt look. And then just pairing them off with boots looks really, really cute. Gives you that like mature look. This next outfit is a much more comfier outfit if that's what you're going for. I'm wearing these cute floral pants. They fit kind of like leggings that I got from Urban Outfitters. They're so comfortable. Like I've I've worn these pants so many times and they're starting to wear out low-key because of how many times I've worn them but they're really comfortable they fit flared at the bottom which look really well if you pair them off with like platform dogs like here and then I'm wearing this white fuzzy top that I got from PacSun and then I'm wearing a white bucket hat a fuzzy bucket hat that i got from h&m and it has aristocats on them the cats from aristocats i love that movie and i love this hat and then i'm wearing this fuzzy white shoulder bag if you guys do want to go for more of that comfy look you can wear a simple white top like i'm wearing in this one and pair it off with a cute hat and then just wear any funky crazy patterned pants so like for this one i'm wearing the floral pants and then i also have these checkerboard pants that i also got from urban outfitters and they fit the exact same way like they're flared at the bottom here i'm showing you this other pair that i recently got this green striped pants that are also from urban outfitters if there's a pair of pants that you have that has a bunch of crazy patterns a bunch of crazy colors just a lot going on pairing it off with a simple white top will look really really cute it'll make your pants stand out even more here i'm showing you three different kinds of pants that you can wear with just a simple white top and black shoes and just a bucket hat or just no hat or maybe a 
cute little headband or cute little clips and this is the last outfit i know i said i was gonna show you guys 10 but i'm gonna show you guys 11 okay this is the last outfit when i put it on i wasn't sure if i liked it and i had to like think about it for a minute because i was like i don't know if it, i like it kind of reminds me of a nun but i'm wearing this cute slip dress this slip dress that i got from depop it has cute flowers on it a white turtleneck underneath that i got from paxson i'm wearing this cute white headband that i got from claire's and i'm wearing this cream purse i'm just wearing the same white socks and the nike shoes but you can wear your docks as well if you want more of that like doll kind of look if there's any silk dress that you guys have or just any dress that you guys want to wear but you don't want to show too many arms or maybe it shows too much of like your chest you can pair it off with a turtleneck underneath or just a button up with like a little collar sticking out underneath or just a t-shirt um like a cropped t-shirt underneath i think layering is such a fun thing to play around with especially if it's gonna be cold in the area where you're gonna be just wearing just a dress like a simple like spaghetti strap dress can be kind of scary because you know you'll be freezing but if you wear like a white turtleneck underneath or a white long sleeve or a white t-shirt underneath Not only will it make your outfit look even more interesting, but it will keep you warm So you don't get sick. Don't get sick guys. Everyone take a jacket Especially if it's gonna be cold You're gonna be inside of the stadium or inside of the place where they're performing and it's gonna be hot And then once you leave and once you go outside it's gonna be cold and that's how you get sick So don't get sick guys. Please take care of yourselves. I ended up really liking this outfit actually When I first bought this dress I was struggling on ways to style it because it fits kind of weird on me and it fits kind of like boxy because for some reason like in the armpit area it fits kind of like wide over here but i noticed after layering it with the white turtleneck it looks really really cute the matching of the white turtleneck with the white headband i think looks really cute this outfit kind of reminds me of i don't know her name but the girl from fairly odd parents the one that timmy yeah the one that timmy has a crush on she has like a lilac outfit it reminds me of that a lot actually now that i think about it and when i wore the headband i did my hair in a side part so i have like these like bangs you know instead of doing a middle part i did a side part editing gamey over here i realized i forgot to explain the other outfit so i'm gonna do that right now so in this last outfit i'm wearing this floral cardigan that i got from target and i'm pairing it off with these white shorts that i got from h&m and then topping it off with this cute bucket hat that i got from urban outfitters it has cute little flowers on it and then i'm wearing this shoulder bag that i also got from urban outfitters that has that same floral pattern i'm just wearing my same nike shoes some white sneakers as you guys probably noticed in a lot of these outfits i wore a lot of floral patterns i feel like if you guys have clothing items that have similar patterns i think matching those items would look really really cute like how i did here with the matching floral print of the cardigan and the bag in the hat that's basically all the outfits that i have for you guys today i hope you guys enjoy this video hopefully you guys like some of these outfits i know some of them are kind of weird i feel like some of them are kind of over the top or just too much but um i'm really in love with patterns and just like floral patterns and just mixing a bunch of colors together let me know which outfit was your favorite um i think my favorite would have to be the last one actually now that i think about it floral purple dress or the um the red velvet one the sophisticated one i really like that outfit too yeah, again, if you guys are going to the Twice concert, I hope you guys have fun and please stay safe, okay? Be aware of your surroundings. Just be careful. You know, it's a lot of people crammed into one space. Don't forget to wear your masks. I feel like concerts really shouldn't be back on, you know, because of the pandemic. But um, since they are, just make sure to keep your masks on. Be considerate of the people around you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to follow me on my social media. I'm very active on Instagram and TikTok. I got a new TikTok account, so make sure to follow me on that new account. If any of you guys are going to the oakland show i'll take pictures of your outfits oh my god i'll take the pictures for you i'll be your photographer have fun at the concert you stole my heart oh yeah never let it go oh, oh. okay